I spend a lot of time thinking about if I'm going to make you squart across the room. Now that turns me on. <laughs> Nothing like having the best oikamium in the world every day. Yeah, baby. <sighs> Kind regards, masses. It's me, High Bike, and I am back with some more Metal Gear Solid Portable Ops. The last song we were listening to was The Stains of Time from Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. Um, okay, so I know I said that I was going to be gone until Tuesday, uh, the last stream, but um, as you may have heard, um, Southern California and, and a bit of the mid, the Midwest, whatever, or like mid- what? No, Central California. I'm like, what What do we call this part? But um, we have been experiencing some heavy rain. Um, Hurricane Hillary, or at least the, the residue of Hurricane Hillary, like it, it shrunk down to like a tropical storm, but um, there have been flash flood warnings throughout the day. But also like um, the road to Vegas is also like pretty flooded too. I hear that um, around Barstow, which is like one of the cities we passed by on the way there, there was like a telephone pole that like fell over on both sides of the freeway. So like that kind of blocked it off. So I'm not in Vegas. But instead, we did go to LA to pick up um, some relatives, which are the Canadian relatives I mentioned. So they're here now. But I'm just here at the house, just chilling, enjoying the sound of the rain outside. But yeah, if you want to listen to that song, I'll leave a link in chat right here. You know, it, it's fitting because, you know, washing away the anger with the rains, the stains of time. Yeah, it's uh, worse than Florida. Like, it's weird because we've never had a tropical storm here before. Like, I think this is the first one um, recorded in history, if I remember correctly. But, I mean, definitely, like, if there was a tropical storm before, like, this is definitely the first in, like, a long, long time. Um, but, yeah, um, I think it should last until Tuesday, and this is, like, only the beginning of it. So, <laughs> yeah, um, I'm here. And also the pre-stream video was uh, Snake's Oegamion. <laughs> that, that's just my pre-stream video for these Metal Gear streams now. But how are we doing today, Gecko, Chuck, Jacob, and Lozo? What's up? You're here, but you're playing Omori, having a wondrous time, feeling all different kinds of emotions. Yeah, Omori do be hitting like that. Yeah, like, I do like having the rain, but guys, you want to know what's whack? Like, we we just entered, like, when we came back home, um, like, in the city, like, there was- or not the city, like, we were on the freeway, but we literally saw, like, a car crash, like, happen right in front of us. Like, um, these- there, like, one car, like, kind of slid a bit, and then it hit another car, and that- like, second car, like, just totally crashed. You could see the person's airbag, like, activate, um, just, like, right in the middle of the road. I hope they're okay. Luckily, there was a tow truck that passed by, so, like, um, he pulled over to help them out. But, yeah, like, um, that's how bad the, the floods have gotten. I think this was, like, around maybe, uh, 2 p.m. But, yeah, <laughs> um... To, to my California peeps, just stay safe out there if you are going to go out. Otherwise, just stay in. Um, though I do have to go out tomorrow because I'm, I'm going to get myself, like, COVID tested because of that exposure we had at work. I just haven't been able to, like, get a proper test since then. We've just been busy. But yeah, I, I really hope no one got hurt in that one crash. Yeah, if it didn't kill him, the airbag punching the face will. Yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately, that can't happen. Yeah. You didn't get hit by Hurricane Arlene when it passed through, just straight up avoided your area. Okay. Wait, which one was Hurricane Arlene? But okay. At least, um, you guys were lucky. Yeah, at least it didn't pass by you guys. But yeah, climate change is a hell of a drug. Like, this is insane. And on top of that, there was also an earthquake, apparently. Um, just as we hit town, because I was looking um, at the group chat for my work, and they just said that um, our work building, you know, they felt an earthquake. I don't know how bad this earthquake was, because, like, I did get an earthquake alert earlier, but I didn't feel anything. But, uh, yeah, it's just, uh, <laughs> it's just, uh, California's just experiencing the rapture, I guess. 
next thing you know, spontaneous fires. Or, or maybe even snow. Here in, like, Bakersfield, it hasn't snowed since I was three years old, so, like, I, I, I wouldn't have remembered that, but I was, like, talking about it with my coworker. It's like, yeah, we're just gonna get everything. You had your time with an airbag and it sucked. It hit so fast it burnt. Yeah, see, like, it's, it's odd that those things are supposed to keep you safe, but then you could still, like, get, like, you know, pretty bad physical damage from it. So, yeah. So, I went through East Florida. Oh, so wait, Gecko's Floridian, huh? Okay, you know what? You did have the Florida man energy, so okay. That checks out. And yeah, face cam's great, right? <laughs> For the full- hold on, I'll show you guys the full thing. But, like, Jacob made it. Thank you once again. Um for making this beautiful meme. Hold on, let me show you the full version. I actually have um, the image open right here. Yeah, remember remember uh, when the Beyblade hit the Twin Towers? Yeah, <laughs> the, the history of the Beyblades. You were a Floridian as of earlier this year. Oh, well, I don't know. It seemed like it was destiny. You, are, you always had that Flor <coughs> excuse me, Florida man energy. Wait, I don't even remember when you started, like, coming to these streams, but anyways. You're in the beginning of Omori, but it's getting good. Cool. Whatever I was doing. That's not the right video. Hold on. Like the good old days after 9-11. There we go. You followed back in P5 Pyramid. That was from a raid. Oh, that's right. That was, okay, yeah, that was, like, last year, huh? Yeah, okay. But, yeah, at least you're good, Chuck. Yeah, like, I think... Honestly, when we were in LA, the only thing was just, like, fl like a little bit of flooding on some of the streets. But it did take us longer to get back home, because we left here around, like, 9.40ish. And then we got home around after 2. It's because everyone was driving so slowly in the rain. But yeah. We spinning to winning tonight, boys. Yes, we are. All right, well, enough of that. Let me go ahead and get um, the game set up. I also tried um, a McDonald's freeze for the first time. I had the Sprite Lemonade. They spell lemonade like L-Y-M-O-N-A-D-E. And it was pretty good. You know, it actually... No, no, not again. It actually does taste like, um, lemonade. Like, and Sprite. Um, but yeah. Yes, that lemonade. It's pretty good. I liked it. How are we doing today, Wins 10 y Can I call you Wins for short? Welcome to the stream. Hope you enjoy your time here. You had to run, walk 10 miles home yesterday. Why? Damn. I could never do that. Actually, I feel like I've done, like... I feel like I've done, like, at least a 10-mile walk once. Because, like, I remember when we went to Yosemite, we got lost, and we were, like, walking around so much. It felt like it could have been 10 miles. Like, we... We walked the wrong direction back to our car. Like, what we thought was, like, the right way to our car was actually, like, the opposite way. And we didn't realize that until way later, so we ended up having to, like, loop around, like... Quite a bit. You got abandoned. Got followed for half a mile by a bloodthirsty crackhead who had a knife. Jesus Christ. Well, I'm glad you made it out of there safe. You thought he said good old lemonade? Oh yeah, I mean, what? <laughs> of course, good old lemonade. I, Sundowner definitely seems like a guy who enjoys lemonade. Okay, first things first. We need intel. Did you get some kind of briefing before the mission? The first recon target we were given during the pre-mission briefing at Fort Bragg was here. A Soviet frontline patrol base. This will be our first target for information collection. I can take you there. I've got a good idea of where it's located. Well, more like I don't know where any of the other facilities are exactly. It'll do. So what's the plan? This place is packed with soldiers. The perfect target for our first recon. Get as much intel as you can. You should be able to extract useful information by listening in on soldiers. Alright, we'll go with your plan. Let's be sneaky. All you had to do was stare the crackhead down? Well, alright. 
I'm glad that worked in your case. Campbell Chunky? Campbell Chunky. <laughs> Looks like we'll make a great team, Snake. Okay, let's get moving. Intimidation tactics go hard? They do until they don't work. Alright, well, I think we're supposed to go here. This place is packed with soldiers. The perfect target for our first recon. Yeah, okay, I know you said that. Alright, we're going in. Let us commence with the mission. In my jeep. You could have ran him over anyways. Well, good. Okay, now get out there and su uh, sus out the situation. He was 5'6 max and had a very lanky figure. And how tall are you? You can learn a lot from what the enemy is saying. Just get close to an enemy and listen carefully. I know you can do it. When you're approaching an enemy, hold the triangle button down as you move. That will muffle your footsteps during your approach. Jesus Christ, you're 6'2? Okay, alright. Well, good for you then. <sighs> got it. Man, okay, we gotta sus. We gotta be sus. Hmm? Something wrong, Campbell? Uh, no, it's just got dizzy for a second. How is that surprising? Listen, I don't encounter that many tall people in my life. Like, most people around here are maybe like 5'10 at least. I mean, we have tall people. It's just, they're very rare where I live. I've only seen like, maybe like a handful of people over six feet where I live in my lifetime. Uh, no, it's just got dizzy for a second. You sure you're all right? How's the fever? I'm fine, and there are more important things to worry about. <clears throat> Take care of yourself. We can't afford to have you out of action now. Yeah, I know. Okay. Let's look at our map. So we have to go there, but let's also just be on the lookout for anyone. A weapon that can obliterate all major cities in the motherland? Give me a break. You've been watching too many- excuse me- movies! No, no. This ain't no joke. I heard that American officer, the one our boss brought in, say something about it. You mean that tight-ass peg leg? You should have seen that bastard's face when the topic of the weapon came up. There must have been something in that document that arrived from HQ the other day. Oh my god. Listen, wins. <laughs> Just know that I burp a lot, so there's no point in doing a burp count. I get annoyed by that. Literally every stream I burp, so there's no point. Probably just has a bad case of the runs. I know I do. Nah, it, it's good. I just... We've had someone do burp counts before and it, it pissed me off. But I'm just like, ugh. It woke up your dog? Well, good. This isn't a joke. Look, I know what you're saying. Aiming that thing at our motherland? That just doesn't sit right with me. Yeah, it's suicidal. But it's just a threat, right? A bluff? He's an expert at this sort of manipulation. I hope you're right. Do you ever wonder what kind of weapon we're really storing? Sometimes. But this is not your run-of-the-mill nuclear missile we're protecting, that's for sure. Okay, so that's some intel we got. Alright, we'll head the other way. This way. Actually, I don't think they're gonna see. They're not gonna see me. 
Oh, wait. I don't think we can go back here. Never mind. I'll make my way. Or hold on. Did it... Ew. No, wait. That was right. Such video game character. Yeah. Okay, no, that's not it. Going here? Ooh, okay. What's my no we're good. Oh. Better get this thing equipped. Just in case. Yeah, it's cool. I don't I don't need more ammo. Oh, but yeah, we watched Super Bad on the Discord server last night. I'm that was my first time watching the movie. Like I think like three out of uh, four of us had never seen the movie before, and it was great. McLovin is like the best character. Oh, who's there? They didn't see me, did they? No. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Let me see. Can I shoot this guy? Introduced to the McLovin. Yeah, like. He's great. He is the best, obviously. Yeah, ev everyone knows that. I just didn't expect him to be like hanging with the cops. Or the cops to be like that, which was great. You have a McLovin sticker? That's great. Probably porta pot It's porta potty time. How are we doing today, Hasbulu? What's up? Okay, they won't see me. I think... Do I want this guy's No, I don't want this guy's stuff. I'm good. Okay. Where does the map want us to go? Oh, where's that? Hold on. Okay, never mind. I'll pass by him again. Might be around here. I'm gonna just sneak you back over here. Oh my god, I'm surprised that guy didn't even see. See me. And he won't see me. Okay. Oh. Where exactly are we heading then? Where is that? You're good just relaxing. Helping a mate lift marble countertops over the weekend. Thighs sore AF. Yeah, oh. Marble countertops. That is definitely a lot. So, you know, glad you can kick back and relax now. That's a guy. Hold on. Oops. I forgot that was a save state button. You didn't see me. Hmm. I think I'm getting used to the controls. But... Uh... Yeah. Bro would not be sneaking if this was real life. Or would he? Snake is dummy thick, yeah. I was headed to Vegas. Yeah, so um, those of you just coming in from the last streams, um, I was supposed to go to Vegas, but there, because of the hurricane, tropical storm, whatever, um, we did not go. Because uh, the streets, the, the freeway on the way to Vegas is like also flooded. And we had to pick up our relatives from um, LA in the first place. Because, like, the whole plan was to go to LA to pick them up early in the morning and then go to Vegas. But because of all the the flooding, heavy rain and whatnot, we couldn't go. So I'm just here now. And it sucks because I wanted to go, you know, to Vegas, you know, hang out with Chris again. And just overall enjoy Vegas and gamble. I even got like 80 bucks like out of um out of my bank account just so I could gamble. But no. It's okay, it's fine. There's always another time. We go to Vegas like a lot anyways, so it's fine. Oh <gasps> I'm gonna choke this guy out. California wild and on god, for real for real. Huh? <laughs> 
<laughs> hey! Shut up! Oh, I thought I could get away with. Wait! Oh, Jesus. He brought his friends. Well, it's okay, I have the thing I need. Looks like you obtained some enemy documents. Good work. Okay, hope it back to the truck. We'll look them over after you get back. <laughs> oh. Oh, is it just gonna automatically end for me? Yay! Snake, about those documents you found just now. Find anything interesting? You're not going to believe this. Try me. Give Chris my earnings so she can make build a Barbie PC rig for me. Dude, honestly though, I'd love a Barbie PC rig. That'd be sick. Oh man, I could see it now. Yeah, the whole Barbie gamer setup. How are these ops portable? Oh, you know, they're, they move around because that's what portable ops do, I guess. How are we doing today, Ryan? What's up? You like that his face is painted, but then someone sketched on the hair? Yeah, I like- I like this art style. Like, it has a very rough, messy look. It's very raw. And it has, like, that detail. I like it. Yeah, the pro gamer setup. Pink Dante wallpaper. Yes! I'm all for it! Maybe I should dress up my Dante figure, huh? Make him pink. You love an Oppenheimer PC that has a random chance to explode every hour? Oh yeah, living, living it up. Living on edge. The nuclear option. It seems the rebels are actually planning to activate that new weapon they stole. The documents outline details of a launch plan. The date and time aren't mentioned, but it looks like we don't have much time. No way. They're in the middle of negotiations with Washington and Moscow. Even assuming this launch plan is real, it's gotta be a bluff to strengthen their hand. Maybe. Excuse me. But they exterminate us Green Berets. Their own comrades. Without mercy or remorse. Headphones pink and mic is shaped like rebellion. Now we're talking! Yes! Oh my god, pink Dante gamer setup! Yes, I'm all for it. Dude, yeah, no, I really want like a rebellion mic now. That'd be sick. I don't think they're too particular about means to their end. You've seen a vending machine that had Nesquik chocolate milk in it the other day? Cool. I hope it turns out I'm worrying too much, but if they're serious about this, it could ignite a global crisis. Snake, until we have a clearer picture of what's going on here, I think we should assume the worst. Better to overreact now and laugh about it later than ignore this and live to regret it. I can't argue with you on that. Right now, we're the only ones on this peninsula in a position to stop these guys. It's our duty to act before the launch deadline. You're about to build your Madoka Magica PC for real for real? Yeah, that'd be a pretty sick setup too, not gonna lie. Yeah, you're right. Even so, the fact is, there are only two of us, and we can't do this alone. Got any ideas? Snake? When you were listening in on the enemy, did you get the feeling that maybe not everyone's satisfied with their commander? Yeah, some of them were griping about it. Tell me, how hard do you think it would be to recruit some of those soldiers over to our side? Oh, it begins. Recruit them? I'm about to blow. Exactly. We could use any grievances they have against their leader to try and persuade them to join us. Sowing discord among the enemy has been a basic element of psychological- Hold on, I just- I, I, lo I love that you got discord and among next to each other right here. Ohio hentai Luffy rig, gear 5 ram. Yeah, look at all these personalized high biker gamer setups. I see it. Ohio working towards greatness. Psychological warfare since the time of Confucius, right? Play our cards right and we might be able to find out what's really going on. Hmm. Among Us stream when? Yeah, you know, I like playing Among Us with you guys. I just, uh, I don't know. I'm getting a little bit closer to 300 followers, so maybe then. But then again, I do have another idea for whenever that happens. 
Like, I don't know, it felt kind of fast. I think I'm at like 278 followers or something. DC and Omogus. Yeah, exactly. Like, perfect combination right there. Who gets to open my butt rig? Oh, that should be me too, though. <laughs> People get so pressed when you end statements with my friend. Oh, damn. Yeah, why Why would they be pressed? You don't get enough people saying that. It's like that one guy on JJK. Oh. I'm hogging all the rigs? Listen, it's only two rigs. It's only two. That's it, I swear. No, but yeah, I watched a couple more JJK episode episodes today. I- oh my god. And like, uh, Yuji's really gotten along well with the, the muscle dude. And <laughs> there's this part where he says, Full on in English. I'm watching the sub, by the way. He says... He says, like... Thank you very much, my best of friendo! Or something like that. <laughs> and I'm just like, damn. But yeah, I, I just love their bond. And um, also, yeah, the fighting is getting really intense now. And um, I'm not gonna spoil who, but there is this guy who plays a guitar. I don't know how he uses it for his curse, his curse, like, jujutsu, whatever, but, like, I don't know, that's like the last thing I expected from this guy. He's like, like, I didn't like this guy, I was like, oh, he, this guy kind of stinky, but with, 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 like, this guitar stuff, I'm like, okay, you're kind of cool now. Yeah, th that scene's great, yeah, right, wait, which one, the, thank you so much, my friend. Or, yeah, best of friends for life. I love it. I love to see it. You are my friend! Ah. Uh, you seen Gojo use biome expansion and- Yeah, that was wild, right? Oh my god. Like, Gojo's just like... Crazy OP. I can't wait to see what else he can do. Both scenes, honestly? Yeah! There's some pretty great JJK scenes, like, this anime is great, I'm really enjoying it so far. What do you think, Snake? Sugin was saying the same thing. Yeah, it might be worth a try. <laughs> I knew I could count on you. Now first thing we gotta do is choose a suitable candidate. Uh, excuse me, so what exactly does that entail? I'm getting reports that soldiers unhappy with the rebellion can also be found in other areas. Oh yes, I did see best girl Miwa. She's cool. Um, yeah, like, uh, she definitely is up there as one of my favorites from the Kyoto group. I, like, um, I, I also like the muscle guy, because he's, he's funny. But, um, favorite character overall would still have to be Gojo. He's just so goofy. So capricious. Um, but I also really like the- what's his name? Um, the silver-haired one that, like, only speaks in, like, ingredients. Or, like, what, salmon? But, yeah, I like him. And his, his, uh, curse technique is pretty cool, too. The whole fight with Volcano Guy was kinda goofy. It was, wasn't it? I'm getting reports that soldiers unhappy with the Rebellion can also be found in other areas. That means you'll have to drag him back to the truck so we can all have a friendly chat about them joining our little resistance. Go out and give it a try. Yeah, Toge Inumaki. Yeah, that's what it was, Inumaki. It was like... I was gonna say, like, Inugami, but I'm like, that's not right. Yeah, I, I like him. He's cool. But yeah, that volcano guy was calm during that fight, and then... Or wait, or are we talking about Gojo? Because, yeah, Gojo... No, Gojo was just like... You know, his usual goofy self. But didn't lose his composure. Meanwhile, Volcano Guy just kinda... He's just kinda like, what's going on? Oh, and one more thing. We've learned the name of the enemy's Supreme Commander. Who is it? His name is Jean. G-E-N-E. -E. Jean? Okay then, let's get this mission started. Pick some place where there will be enemies, it's easy to convert. So where to, big boss? I guess we're going to... Pr wait. Maybe the comm base? Yeah, let's go there. Sure. Wait, let me make sure... Let me save? No? Won't let me save? I guess not. 
fine. Volcano guy was so cocky at first, right? And then everything changes when Gojo lays everything down. There we go. Let me save real quick. Okay, okay get me back to my... Mission... Okay, yeah, we'll go to the con base. Your task is to find a soldier there who harbors a grudge against Jean. Pay attention to what they say. Once you've found a promising candidate, capture him. Got it? Got it. After Kenjaku said he was like four or five Sukuna finger level. Oh yeah. Man was just tossed around. Let's review. We're going to scout for soldiers with grudges against Jean. Listen to what the enemy is saying. Then, once you've found someone ripe for the picking, grab him, grab and bring them back to the truck. The best time to get them is when they're alone. Once you've got the enemy alone, knock the sucker out. Beat the shit out of the little cocksucker. Now there are several ways to knock an enemy out. You can shoot them in the head with your Mark 22 or put them in a nice chokehold. Here's how to execute a chokehold. First, unequip your weapon so that you're barehanded. To unequip a weapon, yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. Sneak behind the enemy, push, hold the square button to get him into a full Nelson. Yep. Once you've got his arms pinned, repeatedly tap the square button to choke the sucker. Sooner or later, he'll lose consciousness. Kidnapping 101. Love to see it. You can also pick the enemy up and carry him around when you're barehanded by holding the square button while positioned above his body. Then just drag the unconscious enemy back to the truck. That's it. Go get him. Choke the shit out of the little cocksucker. Alright. Do I have maybe like leads on someone? No? Alright. Let's look around for someone. Hmm, I think I can smell someone here. Can't tell if the Andrew Tate Twitter is legit because the bio is so random. Oh. <laughs> so random extent. Hmm. Huh? No, full on chokehold. No, shut up, shut up. Damn it, I'm like doing what the thing said. We're good? We're not good. Oh, wait, I was supposed to listen, huh? I'm gonna go this way. What the hell? That's the Andrew Tate Twitter bio? <laughs> I'm not gonna read that, but what the fuck? That does sound like it's... <laughs> it sounds like a troll. Like, ain't no way. Okay, listen in soon. Yeah, ain't no way, sister. <gasps> no, what that's not- that? Who's that? God damn it. Oh, he got me. Hold on. If it is a troll, it's a good troll because they're paying for the blue check mark, right? Start the mission over. Imagine Andrew Tate saying, I'm so kawaii random desu XD. <laughs> That's so cursed. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother to heal. It's cool. I just want to hear a nice conversation from someone. Like this guy. Real. 
Or wait, do I even have... Do I even have to listen in? Maybe I can just kidnap... Just... Yeah. And this guy shouldn't be too far from our truck, I don't think. Where's our truck? What's that red mark on the map? Andrew Tate having a Haku body pillow because he didn't know Haku was a dude. <laughs> I'm all for it. I, I can I can see it. Huh? Oh shit. What was that? Huh? I thought I thought I had my gun Look equipped. That. Don't call for HQ. <gasps> nice. Fuck it, I'm gonna I'm gonna kidnap this guy. Where's our truck? I like this guy. This guy seems very comfortable. Oh, there's our truck. I'm just gonna bring him all the way back. I will call him... Uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm gonna call him Bartholomew or something. All right. Yeah, I don't care. You're you're coming with us. His name should be Timmy. No, his name is Bartholomew. The next guy can be Timmy. Wait. So, did I actually have to listen? Just kidnapping dudes, great game, right? Right? Um... You can do that in games? Yeah, apparently you can. Maybe I just- okay, maybe I do have to listen. I don't- Hmm. Or maybe I should just kidnap all the dudes. Maybe it wouldn't hurt to do that. Or what if that's our truck? Must have been the wrong truck. MGS mobile game. Yeah, there there were some. I think the main one, or like, well, one of them was MGS Acid, I think. There probably were more mobile games. I can't remember though. No, wait, I don't think Acid was the mobile one. What was the mobile one? I think I remember they ported, like, um, MGS1. Or either that or it was, like, an attempted port. On, like, a Nokia phone or something. It was some kind of thing like that. This guy's still got three stars. Where's where's the truck? I How do we get to the truck? How do we get there? Oh hold on. I I better shoot this guy. Huh? What? Snake? Snake? No, shoot shoot this guy's head. Oh no. He's gonna wake up, and he's gonna be like, oh, what the heck? Oh, there we go. I got you, buddy. Okay, but I do see another guy over there. Hold on. Actually not. I'll, I'll carry this guy everywhere with me. He's gonna wake up and be like, oh, what the heck, dude. I know, right? Not anymore, though. We're gonna keep tabs on him. C 
Kojima is goaded, right? Okay, that was fenced up. Oh, you know what? We'll just go this way. It's cool. Go back the long way. What the dreck? Hold it here. Hold it right there. Dude, that gate up ahead, the, the way the lines are moving, is trippy. Uh oh, I can sense someone on my gate are. Lay it on the fence, famil. But I need this guy in my truck. Two trucks. Teehee, <laughs> casually dragging someone to a truck. IGN, 10 out of 10, right? Is this not our guy? I like this guy though. We've gone through so much together. Come on. He's in my truck. How many? Two trucks having sex. Two trucks having sex. Mom muscles. <laughs> this, God, that song. Oh, oh, you, no, you, you don't see me. Where'd he go? I'll shoot. I'll shoot, I swear. Oh, fuck. Damn it. Oh. Shut up. Oh. Oh, fuck, I'm dying. It's okay. I'll die. I'll just die, it's cool. Because I don't know who the fuck I'm supposed to recruit. What's wrong? Your circuit's gone dead. Give me a status report. Oops. Okay. Hold up. So No, oh, give give me instructions. Hey Jack, how are we doing today? What's up? I need yeah, I'm gonna review again. What boof. Listen to what the enemy's saying. Grab and bring him back to the truck. Okay. All right. Jack Hatchet, man. Got that hatchet. All right, so I guess I'm just gonna listen. Just whoever it is, they're gonna start talking to themselves, I guess. All right, and note to self, the truck is all the way here in the corner. Okay. I'm gonna see if it was Bartholomew. I, I think he was over there. He got that dog in him, for real, for real. Was it this way or- no, it was this way. Hold on. I think it was that way. Damn, now I got two trucks stuck in my fucking head. More like Big Kratos Battle Axe. True. Oh, excuse me. Two trucks. All right, so I'll just listen to this guy, I guess. From under here, he won't see me. Two trucks. What? You don't want to crawl under the truck? There we go. Now, how am I gonna hear what this guy has to say? Oh, he's all the way over there. Oh, better get this equipped just in case. Come on, say something. Or wait, I think... I think they said something about pressing triangle nearby. Here. Two trucks. Two trucks. Huh? What the? How does he sense me? No ah. No ah. Just my imagination. Yeah, buddy. You didn't hear anything. You didn't hear anything. You didn't see anything. Whoever told teachers to tell students that all college professors are going to enforce every rule with utmost efficiency was not cooking. 
Yeah, for real. Some professors just don't give a shit. Song request? Oh, don't tell me. Snake! Two trucks? Yes, good. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Oh, get down! God damn it, Snake! Fuck off, Snake. Okay, hold on. We're gonna... Let me get... I'm pretty sure there's a two trucks karaoke. Let me, let me find it. Two trucks. It's fucking stuck in my head. Yes! <laughs> there we go, I found it. Alright, so... Let's enjoy Two Trucks by Lemon Demon. Yeah, hope you enjoy Jacob. Here we go. <laughs> this fucking song. Two trucks having sex. Two trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex. Two trucks having sex. Two trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex. Two pickup trucks making love. American made, built for tough. Two beautiful murder, ma murder machines. American angels in the sky. Grown men cry. Two trucks having sex. Two trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex. Two trucks having sex. Two trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex. Red Bye side. There's ZZ Top. And Robert Zidar. From Maniac Cop. One, two, and three. This barbecue could bring you to your knees. And so could these two trucks. This does feel like it could be an ACDC song. It's got the energy. Yes, this part. Great content, right? Love it. Two trucks holding hands. Two trucks holding hands. The passion, the passion is more than I can withstand. Two trucks holding hands. Two trucks holding hands. The passion, the passion, my big fat heart expands. Two pickup trucks, one cylinder block. Crush my body like a rock. So beautiful. The loop stars tonight, just fireworks and eagles in the sky. Founding fathers cry. Two trucks having sex, the trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex. Two trucks having sex, two trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily <laughs> flex. Yeah, hey, yeah, hey, yeah. Hey ya, hey ya, hey ya. You like to imagine Lightning McQueen fucks to this song? Yeah. Uh huh. Two trucks having sex. Two trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex. Two trucks having sex. Two trucks having sex. My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex. It's so goddamn catchy. One of the songs of all time, for real, for real. Impressive that he never runs trucks with fucks. That's true. Two trucks. Two trucks. Two trucks. But I feel like using fuck would kind of ruin the mood of the song. Or I don't know, like, it'll, it'll kind of tamper with the vibe. I don't know, it feels like fuck should not be used in this song. 9 out of 11, thank you, I'm glad you enjoyed. Oh, <laughs> uh, no, but I mean, on, this, on that subject, there's like, uh, hold on. There's like, there's an Akira meme with this song. It, it's like one of my favorites. 
What? No, no, I have to play it now that- just on the subject of two trucks. What? Where is it? Where is it? It's totally a family-friendly song and using Fox would ruin the family friends. Yeah, exactly. No, but- but honestly though, like... It just- it just, like, there's like a level. There's like a certain level of, like, profanity that you need in a song. And I think he gets it across without having to say the f-word. Hold on. No, I- I have to play it. I know it's in my favorites. Hold on. Where is it? There it is! Leave me alone! Ah! <laughs> the fucking car! Ah! <laughs> and then it doesn't even finish. But yeah, that, that's just like a brief look at my favorites too. <laughs> I fucking love that video. Alright, well anyways, back to um... Back to this. I think we're gonna get caught. Who's that? Alright. You leave me no choice. Okay, I probably shouldn't have done that, but... There we go. I love that they just do, like, these tall-ass flips. Depending on where I kick them. The game seems loud. How's that? Who do I need to listen to? I think that's good. Alright, perfect. We've lost sight of the enemy. Oh, there's a guy there. Mm, I know there was like another guy in there. But maybe this is our guy. I'm hiding behind this thing. Nah, there's no one here. Just my imagination. Yeah. Oh man, I almost had him. So much for listening in on that guy. Man, honestly, why can't we just kidnap random dudes and just just take them all? If you can like wake them up. Here. Oh, there's a legend here. Oh. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Cool. I think our truck is like corner. Yeah, it's cool. I'll take them. Whatever.
our corner truck. Yep. So we, you, you really don't want to just take this guy? Never mind, we didn't- okay. He- I guess I wasn't in the right place next to the truck. Alright, well, we got him. Ooh, and we got comic style too. You! Hey! Mission accomplished. You heal up pretty quick. Thinker too. They trained you well. You're a good soldier. Kinky, right? Who, who are you? Pretty. Call quick. me Snake. Snake. Is that a code name? You must oh, be with the Americans. Name. Are you with the Fox unit too? I'm not with the Americans or with Fox. I'm just a soldier. Just a soldier. Then why? We're here to stop Fox unit from going renegade. A member of Fox named Gene betrayed the U.S. government and stole a top secret weapon. He plans to He's use that weapon and the warheads in this base lot. as bargaining chips wow. to negotiate with your Snake country. Snake cheating on his man. Like We're here to put a stop to it. Our mission is to free the soldiers of the San Geronimo Peninsula from Gene's control and capture the traitors in the Fox unit. I can understand if you're afraid of Fox. But we need others to help us free the Soviet soldiers on this peninsula. You're sneaky. Will you join us? You're here to save us? Yeah. And you want me to help you defeat Gene? Yeah. <laughs> What's so funny? You think he's been brainwashed? Brainwashed? Is that what you think is happening here? <sighs> A fine joke. But I'm afraid you two have it all wrong. Wrong? We didn't rebel because of Gene. Our country betrayed us first. Flashback. We have stood guard over this godforsaken base, unable to reach our friends and loved ones because of the secrecy of our mission. The climate was brutal. The meals were meager. We watched as our comrades succumbed to disease or died fighting the Colombian government. And still, we went on carrying out our mission, Is believing our efforts were all like for Robin the good of the Dallas. motherland. And how did the motherland reward us? By stabbing us in the back. Like Miller. You're talking about the Kremlin's policy shift. Once again, the true villain if is the, the American government. the existence of this base came you know, to light, like life, the political fallout with the United States could fatally undermine Moscow's position in the strategic arms limitation talks that Brezhnev is promoting. That's why we have no use for political rationales. What matters to us is that Mother Russia wiped this base from existence. And instead of allowing us to return home, the army erased all traces of communication and cut off our supplies. Dun, dun, dun. They sought to isolate the peninsula and make it look like this was all the work of a few out-of-control soldiers. We were abandoned by our own country. That's why you decided to follow Gene? Gene told us he would build us a nation. Back there. A nation not of soldiers, but for them. We do not follow Gene out of fear. He will deliver us justice. The only thing we fear is losing that justice. That's why we follow him, not you. You'll never be able to stop him. Justice, huh? Is this where Big Boss got the idea? The meaning of yeah. justice can change from one day to the next. A professional soldier never brings justice into the mission. And then they wreck the only ones who need a reason to fight life. are the ones who fight for a living. That's what my mentor told me. Politics like, basically are fickle. Kinda do like the they same change stuff with the times. In a peace walker. So long as we remain loyal to our countries, it's just soldiers like us need different. nothing to believe in. She died out of loyalty. Not to justice. Not to her country. To herself. For the mission. Rip. Your mentor, the one who taught you the art of battle. Who was she? They called her the boss. I killed her. The boss? The legendary soldier? And Snake, you must be Big Boss. Yep, You're the hero me. who killed Colonel Volgan at Groznygrad. Justice <laughs> Kelp. 
prove it. 8,999. That's, That's what the a lot of justice. Told me. I still don't know what she meant. How? Prove your loyalty. Not to justice. Not to your country. But to you. But to yourself. Yeah, myself. Does Jean truly plan to threaten the motherland? Yes. Snake procured documents from a patrol station that confirm as much. If launched from this base, the weapon Jean stole could deliver a devastating blow to every major city in Russia. I know it's hard to believe. No, I believe you. Not as a member of the Red Army, but as a soldier. I appreciate it. I will follow you. Snake, give me my mission. Yay. What is our next mission? <laughs> okay, Snake, what's the plan? I think Campbell has tuberculosis. Hey, Campbell, are you sure you're alright? I'm fine. I'll get over it. Now about our plan. He's definitely not fine. Yeah, for justice, let's roll those credits. If we're going to collect- If we're going to keep collecting intel, we'll need to pick up some more new recruits. Of course I'd recommend putting together a unit of four soldiers, but if you want to continue on with a sp <coughs> excuse me, a smaller unit, that's your call. So we need two more. For now, let's use the buddy system and pair you up with the one we just caught. You can organize your unit using Manage over at the briefing menu. Push the X button to bring up the briefing menu and select Manage. We'll put you and your new friend down as Team Alpha, alright? The new recruit is registered as a rookie, so... Move that guy over to your team, Team Alpha. Don't forget, we've got Bravo, Charlie, and Delta teams you can fill too. Recruit more comrades and fill those ranks. Just remember that there will be plenty of missions that only you can lead, so make sure you move to that team before deployment. The curry acting up? What curry? You eat curry? If you need more detailed instructions, push the select button to do the home screens, blah blah blah. Okay. Let's see, manage. That's me. And then... There he is, Jonathan. Drive through the soldiers faster, place and sneaky. Oh, that's the wrong one. There's Jonathan. Oh, so he's not Bartholomew or Timmy, he's just Jonathan. Johnny for short. Okay, I'll save. Mission time. So, let's go to the supply depot, maybe? The boss Campbell sick. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but his symptoms look like a form of tropical malaria I've seen before. Not the malaria. What? The first bout has subsided. He's lying down here beside me now. Are you positive it's malaria? I know we took preventative drugs. I'm not a medic, so I can't say for sure. But judging by these symptoms... Hey, don't try and get up! Snake, it's me. I'm in bad shape. Malaria. Who'd have thought? Take it easy, Campbell. 
What do we do now, big boss? The preventative drugs don't work. This could be just the beginning. If he's got some tropical disease other than malaria, there's no telling whether we might start showing the same symptoms. Yeah, he could be spreading. Good point. I got an idea. Keep an eye on him. Give me a minute to consult with my family doctor about treatment. Oh yeah! My PCP. Huh? Family doctor? Paramedic. Let's head for the communications base. Let's hope it's not Fox die, right? R right. The communications base. Got it. Sorry. Seems to be such a pain in the ass, Snake. Save your strength. On the way, we'll keep our eyes out for new recruits. There doesn't seem to be anything to report at the moment. Oh. Oh, okay. So, do they want me to go... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Call... Wait, unless... how do I do that? Oh, so that's our level right now. Hmm, I'm confused. I am confusion. Wait. Oh, there we go. We need detailed info on malaria and its treatment methods. And we need to use the satellite communications facilities so that this doctor, paramedic, can tell us what to do, right? Sneak into the base and make your way to the communications equipment. Take care not to be seen. The symptoms have subsided for now, but there's no telling when I'll have another outbreak. Time is of the essence. I'm counting on you. Yeah, I got you. I got you, Campbell. Good. You made it inside the communications base. They've probably beefed up security, but you've got to stay out of enemy sight until you reach the communicator. I don't know how many more of these outbreaks I can take. We've got to find a cure, and soon. <sighs> I know you can do it. Is it paramedic? Johnny! Big boss, let's go over how to switch team members. You won't be sneaking in alone anymore. We'll all be sneaking in together. I thought that going in alone was the whole point of a sneaking mission. Right, I know. Going in all at once wouldn't be very bright. We'll move one at a time and switch off as we go along. What do people do when it's not their turn? We'll have them hide nearby. After all, there's plenty of cardboard boxes in the truck. Oh, alright. I'm used to hiding in cardboard boxes. When you want to switch off with another team member, press the start button to bring up the map screen. Then select member change. Then you'll be prompted to select a hiding point, a location on the map where you can hide. Choose one as a place to hide. So that's what that's for. Finally, choose a team member to switch, yeah, switch with. Excuse me. Then you're done. Okay, we'll do that. From what I've seen, there are a lot of soldiers around here dressed like me. I should be less conspicuous than you. I used to be a rescuer, so I'm pretty good at dragging people around. Ugh, pretty good. Meaning I'm perfect for gathering new recruits. So make good use of me. Okay, you know what? Yeah, let's let's go switch with Johnny. Go to point one. Or, no, hold on. Point two might be closer. Go there. Let's try playing as Johnny for a bit. Is that a smoking, like, chameleon or something? Okay, it's my turn now. Wow, called on by Big Boss himself. This is going to make a great story when I get back. Watch yourself out there. If a unit member is dressed like the enemy, they can slip through the enemy's guard as long as they don't act strange. Sometimes you'll see a blue chameleon icon appear at the top left of the screen. Oh yeah. <sighs> that means the enemy believes you are an ally, so they won't sound any alarms. 
Unfortunately, a legendary soldier such as yourself doesn't qualify for this special type of infiltration technique. Yeah. Alright, show me what you can do. I'll keep listening from here and let you know where the enemies are, as far as I can tell. The red circles on the map screen are the locations of enemy soldiers. We knew that. They show us where the enemies are on or... Thanks, I'll put it to good use. Alright, here I go. Wish me luck. Oh, it's the chameleon's tongue. Okay. Damn. It would have been cool if it was smoky. Alright, so... Let's see. We need to go... Um, there. Alright, so we'll just, uh, walk along. Okay, well, this, this is a cool thing. I don't remember if something, some mechanic like this was in Peace Walker. So that's cool, I can, like, just sneak around inconspicuously. Huh? Who's that? What? What the heck? Oh hell no! Nah. That was an explosive barrel! Johnny! Johnny, get up! Oh fuck! This is patrol! Enemies! No! Johnny, no! Damn it! We lost one! Select the next soldier immediately! Oh my god, Johnny! No! Oh hell no! Nah. I hope he's not fucking dead. Damn. I hope Johnny's not dead forever. Huh? Oh. The enemy's here. No. Nah. Shit. Well, I'm still in evasion mode, so that's cool. They're not gonna find me. No, sir. HQ. This is HQ. This is patrol. Okay. We've lost sight of the enemy. Commence alert formation. Acknowledged. The enemy is still nearby. No. I'm like, I don't know if I want to use my med kit. Oh, quick. Steak, what are you doing? Go this way. What the heck? Dude. What the? No. Huh? What was that? Uh-uh. Huh? What the? What? Why'd they boot this out of the cannon? I'm not sure if we ever got an explanation for why. What the? <gasps> huh? Who's that? What the hell? The enemy- <laughs> this guy out of the way. Cool. Okay, so the building we want is somewhere over there. Double checking, but that's an enemy. All right, I will be very careful. He's just right there. I 
under though, can I like... <gasps> This one. I have to make sure that he's not looking now. Is this the building we wanted? Yeah, okay. People will be so surprised when they find- Oh, get in. When they find out someone bends the definition of a word to fit the narrative. A narrative, even though it happens all the time. HQ. Yeah. This is HQ. All right. This is patrol. All clear. Wait. Understood. Huh. Return to your position. Oh, probably the next room. There we go. Get in here. Okay. Everybody here? Oh, he's okay. We're all set, big boss. Everybody's here. So this family doctor of yours, is she that good? What a thrill. With darkness and silence through the night. How are we doing today, Yukiko? What's up? Yeah, you could say that. She saved my life more than once. Snake, you came all the way back to the communications facility? You must really want to talk to me, huh? Yeah, actually, I do. One of my men has come down with malaria. Malaria? Can you get some- Can you get some preventive drugs? Depending on the drug, it can be used to treat malaria even after symptoms appear. You're just chilling for now before going to bed? Alright, well yeah, this stream can definitely, like, you know, be a place for you to relax. In the meantime. We've been using the drugs, but they don't seem to be working too well. Do you think it might be some other kind of disease? Hmm. Wait. Excuse me. You said these were malaria symptoms? Yeah, no question about it. I got it. What? Do you know how people get malaria? Yeah, the virus is transmitted by mosquitoes, right? It's not a virus. It's a parasite. And he got ligma! Damn! Parasite? You mean there's an actual bug inside his body? Exactly. In tropical malaria, the malaria parasites gestate within female Anopheles mosquitoes and are then transferred to human hosts. Ordinarily, the drugs would prevent the symptoms from appearing. But there are different populations of malaria parasites. In certain areas, the populations are drug resistant. You know what that means? The drugs won't work? Bingo. So the only way to treat it is to find a different drug that's effective against that particular population of malaria parasite. A different kind of drug. Try the local medical facility. They should have a supply. But you'd better hurry. You might already be infected with the same parasites. It's only a matter of time before you start to develop symptoms. Got it. Rot row, not the mosquitoes. Ugh. Or a bug. Parasite, whatever. Big boss, I need to talk to you. What's up? Paramedic was saying that we need some medicine to treat malaria. Yeah, if there were a hospital nearby, I'm sure it'd have a supply in stock. I know where we can find one. A hospital? Yes, there's a hospital in the sector my former squad patrols. I can tell you exactly where it's located. It must be my lucky day. Lead the way. Yes, sir. Oh, and one other thing. Go on. It's a small hospital with minimal facilities. In the mountains. But just the other day, I saw them bringing in a huge shipment of drugs and medical supplies. What for? I don't know. But what I do know is that this shipment was way too big for a hospital of that size. Sounds suspicious. Sussy. In any case, Snake, we better hurry to the hospital. They've got to have some malaria drugs there. And I'm guessing it'll be a prime location to recruit new comrades with medical powers. Might as well recruit some new, some new allies for the battle as head. Yeah, but <laughs> I'll just read that over again. Might as well recruit some new allies for the battles ahead, right? 
Since you're operating as a team, you can all work together to get new recruits. For instance, when you knock an enemy out, you don't have to drag him all the way back to the truck yourself. Oh! Oh! Why not drag the body over to one of your teammates hiding in a cardboard box? Let them do the rest of the work. Yes, let them do it. Go ahead, give it a try. Now let's get going to that hospital. Find the malaria drugs. <sighs> and recruits the medical staffers along the way. Okay, we're going to hospital, but first... First, let me save. Or let me uh, manage first. Okay, Jonathan's okay, but he needs to heal. Uh-oh. Well, luckily, it's mostly gonna be me doing the work, so I think I'll be alright. Yes, there was a hospital in the sector my former squad patrols. I can tell you exactly where it's located. There better be some malaria drugs there. Jonathan is okay. Jo no, no, he's fine. He'll be okay. Campbell here. We've assessed that the drugs are in that hospital. We're just not sure where. Find those drugs and avoid detection. We now know that I'm not the only one at risk from malaria. Any of our comrades could be infected. Unless we act first, it won't be long before we're goners. Good luck. No, Campbell kind of got the Dante hair. Ooh, I'm liking that guitar. Mm. All right, so there's two sections to go to. Not from there. Or, okay, we'll go this way. Wait, could it be? Is that a... Ooh, rations. Oh, let's go on this way. Yes. Oh, hold on. Let me drop something. Um, we don't really need, um... We don't need that, I don't think. It's fine. We're definitely gonna need these rations. Oh wait, I think I just picked them up. Yeah. Get this equipped. There's a guy over there. Okay, I'm gonna look for a door around here. Oh, door. Stop moving. <sighs> so silent, no one would notice. Absolutely no one. Um, so like... Oh, right. You're not gonna pick this person up? There you go. Um, so like, uh... Ooh, med kits! Maybe... They said that other members could do it, so like... Or maybe I just straight up have to go... Hold on. Mm. Yeah, I want... I want him to... take this person. Snake, grab her. Grab her, Snake. You were just holding on to her. Sna 
Oh! My fingers were over the wrong buttons. med kids, yeah. Oh shit, there's a guy there. This is our truck. Yes. Stop dropping her! Get in there and recruit her! Oh my goodness gracious. Huh? <gasps> what the? Oh. oh wait, that seems like a potential dude too. What happened? not knocked out what the dude don't you want to like join me hq huh what the huh what ah. <sighs> I still don't get how we can get other people to recruit. Oh shit, he doesn't have- Excuse me, he doesn't have med kits on him. Oh no! This is the only weapon I have! Saws, mates. I was gonna be like, I can recruit them, but then they're fucking dead. Right, okay, you know what? I think I <gasps> have to get. No, stop. I have to get in this way. <gasps> what are you doing? Oh. You drag people close to your mate hiding in a box. What the? Huh? And the then enemy's went the here! Way. Souped up. It's the. <gasps> The screaming! <laughs> yeah, that? okay. Let, let's try that again. Food bar. Yeah. Nothing left to do. Can't be saved. Alright, so... Drop. Drop that. We now have ration. Give me this. Full combar. <laughs> full combar. They really put full combar on this sandwich. All right. So let me look at my map again. I mean, we can just. I can just. You know, do the thing. Wait, where are we? Ooh! Yes! 
Did you find the drugs yet? Drugs. What? Oh, I see. They weren't in there. Alright, then try the other rooms. There are other rooms there, right? Take your time and search them in order. Yeah, I'm just scouting around. Calm down, Campbell. Jeez. Okay, so... Yep, that building should be around there. But I gotta be careful. I can hear someone, I think. Oh wait, I think it's um I don't know why yeah, I aim better when I'm like this. I still want her. Cause she's like the first person I saw here. Uh huh? Huh? Dude, I shot you! You should go unconscious. Fuck off, me. <laughs> the screaming. HQ. This is HQ. Oh, oh. Enemy sighted. Requesting backup. No. What the heck? Oh no, there's another guy. Oh my god. What's wrong? Your circuit's gone dead. Give me a status report. Oops. What am I doing to the poor woman? I was just trying to get her on my team! Now we're gonna fucking die again. Alright, here we go. Uh -huh. The enemy's here! No, shoot! Oh! Oops! What's wrong? You're oh my god! <laughs> oh great, I'm stuck in this loop. Hold on, I have med kits. I have med kits. Should have just taken them. I'm dropping the ammo here. What? I thought I dropped that shit. Where was the first? Okay. Yeah, I want to go to the first door because it's like there's nothing there. Wait, we do have two trucks here, huh? Two trucks. But that is a truck. I don't get it. How do you activate- Two trucks! My muscles, my muscles involuntarily flex! Okay, but this is a truck! This is a truck, put him in. Fine, I'll utilize the member change thing, but where's the box? Where's my- where's um, Jonathan's box? It's around here somewhere, right? Oh wait, there's like a- another spot that's around here, I think. 
got plenty of time. This guy's knocked the fuck out. What the? What Where? Was that? What happened? Where? Oh my gosh, really? Find the drugs yet? Nope. Yes, I am playing this on my PC emulator. How are we doing today, Charlie? Ganondorf counseling my marriage with Yosu. Oh, Ganondorf, a real one. This is HQ. This is patrol. We've lost sight of the enemy. Commence alert formation. Give me those drugs. Acknowledged. The enemy. This is Campbell. Still no luck finding those drugs? I just don't get it. He told us that a huge shipment of medical supplies was brought in, but there's not a trace of them to be found. Something's wrong here. I got an idea. Maybe the shipment log can shed some light on things? Look for the hospital director's office. There must be a record of the drug shipment in there. Mm. And you're doing good? You had a very restful weekend? Ready for work tomorrow? Oh yeah, tomorrow's Monday, huh? Well, I'm glad that you had a nice, ugh, excuse me, relaxing weekend. Morbid as an accountant. I can see it. Oh jeez, so where are we headed? Where was the director's office? <laughs> Counting berry bonds. Of course. Where's the office? Is it this one? 
Yeah, I'm almost fucking dead. Oh, let me see if maybe I could like. Oh, but then I don't. I don't really want to bother recruiting anyone right now. Oh my god! No, shut up! Shut up! Oh god, I'm dead. HQ. This is HQ. What's wrong? Your circuit's gone no, dead. Give me what? a status report. <laughs> Cause Jonathan's almost fucking dead too. <sighs> I got to be really sweet. Yeah, tomorrow's Monday already. I mean, it doesn't matter for me because uh, it's I'm still off. But. Kid to Johnny, huh? We'll get him next time, Chief. Don't pick those up. Sneak. Go that way. that guy but I think I'm too far. Incident. That's it. There's no one here. Man, fuck. Okay, but where, where are the guards? Are they gone? Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, you think I'm gonna step out? I'm not- Oh my god, that guy climbed over the fucking- They, cl they can climb over the desks? What? How do they see me? You can't see me- Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. I'm aborting this mission. No, I'm just gonna end it before it's too late. I, no, 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 there's no point. There's no point. It's fine. All right. Not briefing, but I'll just, no, no, I mean, we'll, we'll just restart the mission. Wait, I could have just restarted the mission, huh? That's all right, it's fine. Blah, blah, blah. No, wrong button. Give me drug. Huh? Me? Oh, fuck. Yeah, 
Yeah, I guess I kind of screwed myself over because if I restarted, because it seems like it remembered some of the things. I think? I'm not sure. I didn't have those rations. Or I guess the rations respawn. Wait, it's nighttime now. Interesting. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait for that one lady to not be there. So we have like, so there's like two sensors. If I could just shoot this one, everything's gonna be okay. I hope. I don't know, I'm like shooting at the head. Huh? How? I hit your fucking head! Man, whatever. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh my god. Where's the med kit? Requesting backup. Acknowledged. Sending reinforcements. I hit her fucking head. How did she not like fucking knock out? I don't understand. Okay, so there are enemies that away and that away. I'm gonna go this away. Ah. Fuck. Bye, losers. Oh, fuck. Bye, losers. Her brain's too smooth. The bullets slide right through it. Apparently. Get under here. They can't get me here. Oh, fuck. No! Oh, fuck off, dude. Hey. No, fuck you. Fuck you! Stupid. Yeah. Yeah, how do you feel about that? Sneaking in. That's what you get for trying to shoot me like that. I'm gonna drag you back with me. Or wait, I can't do that. Give me your shit. Are you gonna stop anytime soon? Why did you drop? I thought that med kit was a target. Did I not just pick it up? single person is my enemy. <laughs> Close the door, you asshole. You're fucking keeping it open. The guard really just did. It's the enemy! Yeah, a lot of them have been doing that. This guy is like sleeping, right? Did I kill this guy? There's like no sleeping things. Did- Uh oh. Well. Oh, he is sleeping. Okay. I'm just gonna be like... Oh, 
Cut the drugs. I don't cut the drugs. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Your shipment of medical supplies. Where's the shipment log? Hospital director's office. But where is that? What happened? Oh, drugs? This is patrol. Enemy sighted. Commence an attack. Just knock the fuck out? What? How? Oh. I don't remember really getting her to pass out. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. This is where we gotta go. Wait. I'll take this. And this. And that. And that. I don't even care about these guys. Fuck them. I'm gonna find the hospital director's office. Yes. List about going materials. Heading for a lab. Huh. Ooh, it's Chopper Coon. Where are the escapees? Why haven't they been caught? If they get away, I promise you'll regret it. Enough of this. Call Python. Get him back here. He'll lead the search team and make sure this lab stays secure. That's me when I see a spider. Oh, ooh. What? What's happening to me? What? What do you mean, Snake? There were no malaria drugs in the hospital. Not even a single dose. According to the log left in the director's office, they hauled every last bit of that stockpile of drugs and medical supplies away. They were shipped to a research lab north of the hospital. But we're in luck. Not only do we know from the log that they took the drugs to a lab, but we found its exact location by following the helicopter's flight path. Quite a coincidence, huh? You'll see when you get there, but the lab is built on terrain that makes it hard to spot from outside. It's the Ligma taking over his body, right? Damn. He's about to die of Ligma if we don't do something about it. And how was my day? It was all right. Yeah, so we picked up some relatives. They were staying at, um, they were staying with some family friends, I guess, in LA. <laughs> so we had to drive through the rain to uh, pick them up. And you know, like the Hurricane Hillary, like turning into a tropical storm, you know, deal. Having everything like, there, there were like flooded streets. But yeah, we, we picked up my relatives and brought them back here to the home. We were supposed to go to Las Vegas this week, up until Tuesday. But because of the flood storm, we could not go. I don't remember if I mentioned this to like some of the other people, but like, um, Barstow is like a city that's on the way from us to Vegas. And like, apparently some thunder hit the telephone pole, like a telephone pole there and it fell blocking like both sides of the freeway um, there. So, you know, that would have gotten in our way maybe. So we just opted to just stay here. And it, it's too bad because I was looking forward to going to Vegas too because we do have relatives there as well. And I wanted to gamble. Like I took money out of the bank just for gambling, but nah, guess not. But yeah, like, it was a longer drive because, like, normally for us it takes maybe around, like, one, two hours. Um, well, one, two hours for, like, a one-way trip to LA, but, um, yeah, it took longer because of, like, the heavy rain and also the flooded streets. People were, like, driving slow. I saw, like, a car crash happen right in front of my eyes on the way back home. And I hope those people were okay. But one of the cars involved did look pretty fucked up because their airbag went off. The car was pretty in pretty bad damage. Um, thankfully, there was a tow truck nearby and um, stopped to help them. But um, yeah, that was that was something. It's it's mostly because of like the roads being all slippery from all the water. But yeah, it's a. I'm just cozy right now, yeah. It's gonna- the storm is gonna persist I think up till Tuesday too, so... 
<laughs> There's that. But other than that, I'm great. Thank you for asking. But how was your day? Chances are slim you'd find it unless you had some kind of clue. Head for the lab, infiltrate it, and search for the drugs again. I'm sorry to put this on you, but I'll need them if I'm going to keep command. Okay, we're going to that research lab. The medical supplies at the hospital have all been transported to the research lab. Head to the lab and search for the malaria drugs again. Wait, actually, don't start yet. I need to save. I forgot. I wish it would, like, automatically heal us up, but I think we have to, like... I think we're going to have to, um... Uh... uh recruit medic medics if we want that to happen. You're doing chores? It's sunny in the Philippines. Hey, you're a fellow Filipino? Hey! My people! Cool, cool. But yeah. Well, I would say cool for sun, but... First off, I'm not really a sun person, and second of all, I know it gets humid over there. So... <laughs> the one season in the Philippines, and it's just like... Or it's like... It's either like, you know... Humid sunny, or like, humid typhoon weather. Anyways... We'll get on this. Dom's from Big Hole, wins from the PI. Who's Horatio? <laughs> but yeah, I'm I'm Phil Am. You you could probably tell by my accent. <laughs> Apparently the medical supplies they brought to the hospital have all been transferred to that lab, which means that the drugs must be there too. Hasbulla's Horatio! <laughs> Damn, okay. Alright. Fuck it, Hasbulla's Horatio now. <laughs> Do whatever it takes to find those drugs and bring them back. We need them, and soon. So who's who gets the honors of being Tito Dick, Dick Man, baby? Alright, so we want to go. Oh, I did not want to do that. Actually, wait, hold on. Kabido Jack Jackman, baby. Yeah, it, it works. It works. Hold on. What if I call? What? Say what if I call? Did you find the malaria drugs? Without them, we could all be wiped out by the disease. You have to find those drugs for us. We're counting on you. Dan Campbell, I just wanted to check in with you. Have a nice talk. This guy's just concerned about his fucking drugs. Man, what drugs do to a motherfucker. Oh, that's one of the hiding spots, huh? The one time I see it. Alright, whatever. Wait, so where's our... Where's our target? All the way over there. Right? Campbell's a fucking addict. Kinda looks like one, too. I thought we could trust him. Man, whatever. <laughs> Alright. Oh, let me, uh, equip my stuff. Oh, yeah. Best to take a ration, please. Or two. Damn, Snake's got, like, too much fucking stamina. If that goes down, he's gonna be all shaky. Oh, wait, I don't sense anyone on my gaydar. I don't have anything to worry about. I'm gonna sneak it. Oh, just kidding. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. What? Snake, what the fuck are you doing? Oh Christ. Quick. Shoot the guy. Shoot the- Oh my- oh, oh, oh. Good thing he's not turning this- oh. Let's recruit him! Okay, so I saw a box back there. If I take this back. Just double check though. Oh wait, there's a there should be a box over here somewhere. I'll let Johnny take care of them. Johnny, Johnny. Yes, papa. Eating sugar, no papa. 
What the? I thought there was a box here. Am I playing on keyboard? Yeah, I am using a keyboard because I am emulating. So yeah, that's why you can hear my keys. It's a fucking box. I won't see one for a while, so. I mean, wait. I mean, we won't see any enemies over here. So we're good. change the hiding point, huh? Alright, Johnny, whatever. I, I just want to at least test this out. You'd rather use the PSP single analog nub than a keyboard. Yeah, right? It's it's much better that way. But unfortunately, I can't really emulate that. I don't- I mean, maybe- you know what? Actually, I wonder if I could get my bootleg PS4 controller to work like that. But it's okay, I'm playing with keyboard, it's fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying my diddly darndest. And it's it's working out better than last time, that's for sure. No, that's what I mean. Yeah, my bootleg controller is a USB controller, but I'm too lazy to plug it in. <laughs> I already got myself used to um, keyboard anyway, so it's whatever. So you want to recruit that enemy soldier, huh? No prop. One of our men hiding in a cardboard box will handle it. You go ahead and continue your mission. Next time, use the radio to give the order yourself. The frequency is 143.15. They, they saved the codex, right? Capture complete! Okay, well that's there, but yeah, like, I thought... Hmm? This frequency is only for retrieving enemy soldiers. I can't tell who it is you want us to retrieve. Make sure you're not in danger when you call. If you want your teammate to retrieve an enemy soldier, you need to drag the soldier's body over to where your teammate is hiding first. Then call me on this side, got it? Okay, I was just- oh wait, hold on. There we go. Okay, if I call Campbell again, he's gonna be complaining about his fucking drugs again, so, so no, I'm not gonna bother with that. I made a friend. Hopefully it works if I try it sometime. I know, yeah, I've been having weird issues with that controller. But I think I might be able to tinker with it. Ah, eat my rations. So, Jack, what am I arguing against? Argue, symmetric button layouts like PS4 are better than asymmetric like Xbox and Switch. Oh man, that's the that's the the problem. I agree with like PS4 like you know being better because like I'm used to that. Like I I have never owned an Xbox, so I don't even know how like the Xbox controllers work. But okay, I will say though, I do like um I don't know. There's something about the Switch. Hold on, pick any side to argue. Oh, that's what you wanted? Okay. Well, yeah, I- it's because I'm used to- 
I mean, I'm used to the Switch too, but actually, when I'm like playing Smash, I don't like that, um, the button placement can be a bit weird and also the analog sticks, so like, it can be iffy, depending on the games you're playing. So I do prefer the, um, you know, the PlayStation layout, like any PlayStation controller layout, because I like that symmetry. Everything seems convenient where where they are placed, so that that's what my argument is. Asymmetric hurts your thumb. Yeah, yeah, like that's another thing too. Like going back to Smash, if I'm like if I'm smashing for a while, you know, those controls don't really help with the thumbs. You know what I mean? Everything is all like it's all like you hold. You hold a certain, like, you hold one side a certain way, and then you hold the other side a certain way, and it's like, ah, oh, this, this don't really hit. This don't really work. It's uncomfortable, it's weird, awkward. You prefer PS controllers too? Yeah, because you grew up with them, right? I mean, I'm mostly a Nintendo person, but, well, I'm, I was mostly a handheld person, but I did like the feel of my PS1. And I like... And the PS4 and the PS2. I've just never owned a PS3. Oh, let me, uh, get this equipped. Alright, Snake, shoot this guy. Huh? What was that? Who's that? Uh-oh. Yeah. No, I can get this guy. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Fine, fuck off. HQ. This is HQ. This is patrol. Oh, 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 And I'm in danger, so I can't do anything about that. I think they're all coming in from there. Fuck. And the thing I want is over there. For some reason, the height difference of your thumbs on the asymmetric stick and buttons will bother you more than the sticks and buttons being on the same horizontal level. Yeah, right? Like, I'm not- I don't know why it's like that, but it, it happens to be like that. I go find higher ground. Oh, I could go this way. Ah! You can't get me in the vents. Oh wait, that's not a vent. Oh Christ, this guy has a fucking shield. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that's so bogey. Wait, what the heck? No. Oh, I don't have any med kits left. I'm gonna fucking die. What's wrong? Try to pull the emotions on them. Give me a status report. Yeah, and then we have the vent to nowhere. Like, what the fuck is up with that? Oh my god, Jonathan, yeah. I... <laughs> Why doesn't he get a med kit? Damn, there like needs to be another med kit around somewhere. Otherwise, yeah, we're fucked. Johnny, my boy. Oh, invisible wall. It's the wrong way. Wait. Oh, was that a... Event. Okay, but tell me this place is gonna lead us to somewhere. We lost sight of the enemy. <gasps> Wait, is it continuing where I left off? No. Interesting. Okay. So there was like a secret, secret tunnel over there. So. We wanna go, oh, we wanna go that way, okay. Wait, I can blend in, right? Give me the con, 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 Straight. Huh? 
Hey, buddy. What the fuck? You're not my buddy. And there's no trucks around. Favorite culture club song. You know, I'll be honest, I don't listen to too much culture club. But, um, hold on. Did they do time or was that someone else? Ooh. Because I like time. But I can't remember if that was them. Or if it was someone else. Is it all just scientists? Because I can knock this nerd out too. Or I'm going here. What happened? What do you mean what happened? Please tell me there's something in here. Just kidding. I'm gonna hide in here. I'm out of here! The enemy's here! No. Somebody! He just ah. passed out! There's nothing- What? Nah! Are you fucking kidding me? Ah. I I was in oh my god. What's fucking wrong? Shit. Your circuit's gone dead. Ah. Give me a status report! Time, Clock of the Heart is the only song you listen to from them. Okay, that was them. Well, I will say that is my favorite by them. What the fuck was that bullshit? Wait, did- Did it keep my guy? Oh no, my guy. I think my guy is like not there. Hold on. I think- Let me double check, but I think I can move. Yeah. Okay, I can move the hiding spots, but I want... Damn it, that's like getting further from where I want. Ugh. I really wanted that one guy on my team. Hold on. Might not be too late, though. Can't I, like, donate my medical kit to Johnny? I'm honestly surprised you made it that far. Like, that long. Yeah, I think my guy's gone. Fuck, man. Fuck. I liked him. Oh, wait, hold on. I, I know. This is probably leading over there. But yeah, that was, it was still a good try. It was a nice... It was a nice run. Alright, my guy... I don't know why it doesn't properly let me uh, aim. Okay, I'll get a little closer. It's not like he's gonna look over here. He's definitely not gonna look. All right, my dude. I think I should be able to drop a med kit then make him pick it up. Oh yeah, I can switch out with him, duh, duh. Johnny, Johnny. Wait. Oh, wait, that's the- no. It's the wrong person. I was pressing the wrong buttons, what the heck? Well, I still want him to have the med kit. You can pick this up, Johnny. That was rations. Fuck, I forgot about that. Well, you know what? Snake can take this guy. Is that a med kit? Take four men in a fight, right? In a fight, right? <laughs> that mean. How do you do, fellow children? Yeah, look at me. I can 
blend right in. Okay, so we want to go over there, but is it like blocked off from this side? So otherwise we're going to have to do a lot of walking. Let's see. What's with all these fucking scientists around? Wait, hold on. Yeah, the sciences. I mean, I don't know, I'm a soldier working here, right? Huh? <laughs> Soldier immediately. <sighs> well, Johnny tried his best. Now I'm back here. Yeah, poor Johnny, man. Huh? The enemy's here! It's the enemy! Gotta be fucking kidding me. You're all here? Wait, how many medkits do I have? One. <laughs> we're not gonna make it. Oh, we're not gonna make it. Man, all I wanted was to recruit that one guy. Oh my god, fuck you. Guys with their shield and the, I'm gonna- <gasps> What? I can roll like that? That's how you roll. Ah! Oh, fuck. What's wrong? Your circuit's We're go not gonna make it anymore. God damn, all I want is that one guy. That one guy is like in the perfect place. Okay, I still want Johnny to get those med supplies over there, so uh, point change. No? Never mind. Just don't die. Yeah. <gasps> so I know we're here. Like, this guy is like perfect. He's just like in the perfect position to get shot. By my friendship gun. What the? Who's that? He was perfect. Yeah. No, fuck this. I'm restarting the mission. I can't- I can't have myself losing health right there. It was so perfect, too. I'll get closer. 
Like, what is even with, like, the hitboxes for their heads? Like, sometimes I swear I'm, like, shooting them in the head. But then the game don't register and I'm like, the heck? on the ground. Yellow. Smooth brain. Who? This guy? Or me? Like, man, I'm like, that, that is a head. Alright, stay there. There we go. Alright, Johnny. You're gonna... We're gonna do our change here. I'm gonna pick up the stuff. The enemies, that's why I'm not getting the headshots. Mm. The brains are too smooth. Johnny sneaking in. As long as I don't get near the scientists, I'm not even gonna bother with those fucking scientists. Alright, you know what to do. I'll use all three, it's fine. Have this equipped just in case. Hopefully, I won't have to use it. No, put that shit away. I want to look friendly for when I pass by my fellow comrade soldiers. Fuck that guy though. That guy needs to turn around. I'm going to ignore him. Why do they seem to detect Johnny anyway, though? Right? Like, he works here. Totally. Well, we made it. What's his status? And well, now we have a new guy! His memory and readjusting his sensory nerves in the culture tank. By my Jeez. estimate, it'll take another 12 hours, at least. Half a day? He has to be readjusted after each deployment. Not much better than a prototype, a test subject. My apologies, sir. The culture fluid takes time to prepare. With such limited equipment and personnel, readjusting null isn't- I know. That's why I brought along a specialist. Du, 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 du. Chief? But- The escaped prisoners have yet to be found. This could be just the job for our perfect soldier. Any interesting we'll reason I want to play this game? The fluid well, I've played Make all of the metal- the main, like, mainline yes. Metal Gear games. But I haven't played this one. Because it wasn't available to me when I was doing my MGS Amanda. binge. Yes, I know. Cunningham. Don't move. So, I did play MGS um, a few weeks ago, like, I, that's when I started, like, the stream for that. Commander, I wanted to play Lieutenant, through the Metal Gear right? series again. We're fine. So, Portable Ops is here on my, uh, Please forgive me, Commander. Lineup. Are you hurt? Don't worry. Don't worry! Fate would never see me hurt. Now. Lie still and try not to move. This man needs medical attention. I apologize for any sense of urgency. Please don't think for even a moment mm. that I hold your work or yourselves in any but the highest of regards. This facility you are helping to build is absolutely vital to the strong roots of our new nation. But never forget that you yourselves are no less valuable a resource to that nation a nation that will house the mightiest most capable military ever seen by man warriors in their prime 
We will end an era that sees soldiers discarded like tools and strike war from the menu of global politics. And it is you, soldiers, military engineers, who are her first citizens. Our nation's riches and its fighting spirit. I only pray that such priceless resources need not be sacrificed in vain. voice and the premonition See, they can detect that the recruit is, is from that the area seems higher ups can detect you easier okay oh yeah because they'd have the experience the keen eye some of these people crying at the speech i know it just hit it just hit for them no luck finding the drugs huh god damn campbell shut up you druggy where the hell could they wait that reminds me. He don't miss? Yeah, he really don't. When you were eavesdropping on Gene and his men just now, didn't you say they mentioned something about a culture tank? Do you think that might be part of the medical supplies they brought in with the drugs? If so, don't you think the drugs might be sh yeah, stored in the same place as the culture tank? But whatever that is, I think it's worth checking out. Okay, go look for this machine. This culture tank. They may have even set up a special chamber to house it. Chamber, huh? Oh, lovely. Okay, so we're gonna keep going. Oh my goodness. I hope it saved, like, from where we're at. Oh, wait, you know what? Can I do a member change or... No. No, I'm still closer. It's cool. It's cool, I, I can still blend in. Oh wait, Ugh, damn it. I keep forgetting that's not the right button. Hold on. Are you late? You just got done streaming? You're not late, but I think I will. Oh, that was, okay, that was a good choice to make. I think I will end maybe soon, cause I'm starting to get a little tired. But, I, 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 wrong button. Okay, so if I just, oh wait, it's in the building that, over there, right? Snake, hello. But how are we doing today, Anthony? What's up? Campbell and his fucking drugs. Okay. Oh, there's an enemy nearby. Hey, stop doing that. I'm gonna crawl this way. Oh, huh, simple. It's just right there. We did it! you read the sign it says do not enter apart from having an itchy neck you're grand getting a bit tired you, yourself a kid yeah. what are you, you doing here i'm home. in charge oh you in charge but glad that you're feeling grand though you there besides itchy neck the rest of you will sweep the prep chamber oh, way, that isn't anything hide there serious. in that locker what just do it what's going on here the preparation chamber is for authorized personnel only. Miss Elisa, are you alone? Yes. Have you seen anything suspicious yes. around here? No. no. Is there something wrong? <laughs> we received a report that there's an intruder in the lab. Someone also reported seeing a suspicious truck nearby. Nothing so well, there's no one here. Just me. And him. You're disturbing his sleep. I'll have to ask you to leave. Yes, ma'am. If you see the intruder, please notify us immediately. Now I've seen it all. 
A little girl in charge of an outfit like this. Why did you help me? I don't know. You had I just had this feeling that I need to. Before they bought it and, and he decided you know not my to. Name? Oh, okay. Are you with the Fox unit too? No. But I mean, hey, sometimes you gotta save up on the money. <gasps> it's what? it's not like that. When I saw you with the heliport with Cunningham and the others. That was my sister. Sister? Her name is Ursula. She's the one who's a member of Fox. Oh. I'm just a medic. You're pretty young. Well, pretty young. You were out on the battlefield when you were my age, weren't you, Snake? Or should I say, Big Boss? <laughs> Ursula and I were I raised in the East German rumbles. lab. They sent all the kids with ESP potential there to study them. My powers are pretty weak, but Ursula pretty is different. Point. She's one of the most powerful psychics in all the communist world. Through special training, Ursula gained great power, but in doing so, lost everything that makes her human. So much so that she can't even talk with me anymore. Four years ago, Jean took us away from East Germany. He was on a mission from Fox. The CIA wanted to get its hands on ESP from the communist bloc. And then you joined his little revolution. Yes, that's right. So, this is what you were calling the perfect soldier. Does he have ESP too? No, he's just an ordinary human being. That is, he used to be. He was raised in a special way, under yeah. very special conditions, to be a great warrior. He's incapable of emotions, or doubts. He's the ultimate combatant, created with one purpose only, to accomplish the mission. He has no human memories, the only thing he has left are his skills in battle. No memories? Each time he completes a mission, he undergoes readjustment. Like this. Inside the culture tank, all five senses are shut out completely. Most men would go mad in minutes. Like a baby who's coming into the world for the first time, the perfect soldier's sensors are honed to a razor sharpness. He can read the enemy's movements and learn them faster than any normal person ever could. What kind of person could endure that kind of extreme training? Nobody, of course. The Perfect Soldier project ended in failure and was abandoned. He was the only success. That's oh. why they gave him the code name Null. He's a lost number. He has no feelings and no memories. Not even a project number. Don't even think about fighting him. You can't possibly win, Snake. Hmm. You could be right about that. Or you could shoot him now, but you'll have to go through me. I'm no assassin. Shooting a soldier with their guard down isn't my style. You're a good man, Snake. I knew you were. Here, take this. It's a drug for treating chloroquine-resistant malaria. How'd you know? <laughs> it's time. Bring the tank out. I trust the readjustments are complete. Sorry. It'll just be a little longer. I'll send a man in to meet you. Hurry it up. You can get outside through here. Head for the harbor. You'll find what you're looking for there. You must be psychic or something. <laughs> One last thing, Snake. If you find Ursula in front of you, don't hesitate. Shoot her. Shoot your sister? If you can't do that, you're already dead. All right, next time, let's try for a more upbeat prophecy. Whew. That was a close one. My fever's all gone now. And yes, that was Tara Strong. She is in this game, which is cool. Well, actually, Tara Strong's in quite a few of these Metal Gear games. Looks like those drugs you got from the girl really work. It gave some to all the men. Well, at least we don't have to worry about losing our entire unit anymore. Yay! We got the Ligma removers. Now what? If we go to the harbor, we might find what we're looking for. At least, that's what Elisa said. The harbor? I have absolutely no idea where that is. Seems we need to do some more recon. What about Johnny? He might know. Or the new guy. The new new guy. Big boss, you got a minute? I've got a plan. A plan? 
kind of plan. We can get all the new recruits we want, but unless we use them, they're just going to be sitting there. And that, if I may be frank, is a waste. I feel it defeats the whole purpose. So what I was thinking was, we could pick a few of them to set up a spy unit and send them to key points on the peninsula. We've all been stationed here a while, so we've got a pretty good idea of how and where to lie low. <laughs> pretty good. And oh, and we make pretty good intelligence collectors too. Pretty good. And correct me if I'm wrong. You're going to want a broader picture of what's going on around the peninsula in order to accomplish your mission. So, what do you think? Spies, huh? Snake, the soldier has a point. Right now, we've only got awareness of the few dozen yards around our truck. If we think we can figure out why Fox rebelled like this, we're not just dreaming. We're crazy. I think sending some of our men out to gather intel is a great idea. Okay, we'll go with your plan. We'll start forming a spy unit right away. You got it, boss. You can manage your spy units by selecting manage on the briefing menu. Uh -huh. Instead of putting free soldiers in the sneaking unit, you'll be putting them into the spy unit. You don't need to put together a spy unit for each location you want to re reconnoitre. Recon Fucking fuck French, man, I don't know. And just let them do their thing. They'll go out and collect intel on their assigned location and report the results back to you. You can see the reports by going to report on the briefing menu. Got it. Try it out. But... We don't have enough men to send them out willy-nilly. Got any ideas where we should start? Well, we do need to find a route to the harbor. Why don't we send a unit out to the supply depot? That's where they store all the cargo they unload at the harbor might give us a clue as to how to locate the harbor. Agreed. In the meantime, I'll keep looking for new recruits. figure it out next time. <laughs> I'm getting tired, so I'll go ahead and save. I'm just like, so where did they want me to go again? But okay, yeah. Thank you guys for tuning into this stream. As always, love chatting with you guys, hanging out, you know, fun stuff, fun stream. If you're just watching, I'm always glad to be entertainment. And you're welcome for the stream. Again, always glad to stream for you guys. Thank you, I will have a nice rest. I'm definitely gonna need it. And you're gonna do more chores? Yeah, alright. Good luck with those chores. Fun chilling to the pre-mission I know, right? Yeah, like... I got some nice ambient music. But, okay, so... Um, it's Monday now that it's past midnight. Um, let me just double check. I think I have a feeling I know what game is gonna be next, but let me just see. Um, yes? Yes, okay. So, later today, we will be playing Suzumiya Haruhi no Chokuretsu. So, look forward to that. Hopefully I can figure out what the fuck to do during that puzzle section. <laughs> But yeah, you know, I am definitely looking forward to more story, that's for sure. Excuse me. But yeah, mata nene, my dudes. I hope you have a lovely rest of your night or day, wherever you may be. And I'll catch you guys later. See ya. Peace out to my California or, like, you know, Western peeps affected by Hurricane Hillary. Or, I don't know, are we still calling her that? Or, like, I know it's a tropical star now, but whatever. Hope you guys stay safe and you know, stay indoors unless you really have to go out. But yeah, just take care. Buy good stream, yeah, fun stuff. But yeah, and as for everyone else, you guys take care too. You enjoyed your stay? Good, I'm glad. I'm glad you did. All right. Well, I'm out for reals. All right. Peace out. 
Matanene. Have a good one. And, uh, yeah, peace out.